Next, we're going to look at post-its. So in the interface, this happens in a part file or an assembly file. There's the option to incorporate post-its or, or notes. They're, I've actually seen them called both. Uh, the notes option, when you open up a file that contains notes, over in the browser tree, there is a call out for notes. And you can expand that and to see all the different notes that you have. So I can double click on note one takes me in here and allows me to see that note, see what that note is, when was it made, and there could be a screenshot associated with that note. If I look at the other one, you'll notice it's a different note entirely and a different screenshot. So how do we incorporate these? How do we use them? Well, if I zoom in right here and I simply right click, I can create a note. And what you're actually doing when you zoom in, you're capturing this area. So you're setting the focal area for the note. And when I create the note, it takes me into the note editor and I can type in whatever note it is. Try that again. Why it's not giving me the ability to type that in, I don't know. Weird. My keyboard's not giving any feedback. Okay, apologize about that. But nonetheless, it still created the note at least. So then now I have a note one, note two, and note three. When I edit note three, I can see what that note is and see that focal area. And again, you can incorporate these into parts or assemblies.